Blue Jays are set to begin their American League Wild Card Best of Three series on the road against the Minnesota Twins this Tuesday. Toronto ended the regular season with a record of 89-73, placing them third in the AL Wild Card race behind Tampa Bay in Texas. In their final regular season game, the Blue Jays were defeated 12-8 by Tampa Bay and lost four of their last six games. Toronto's offensive leaders include shortstop Bo Bichette, who boasts a 306 batting average and a team-high 175 hits. First baseman Vladimir Guerrero Jr. leads in home runs with 26, RBIs with 94, and on-base percentage at 345. George Springer is second in home runs with 21. While Toronto hasn't officially announced their starting pitcher, it is likely to be Kevin Gaussman, who held a 12-9 record with a 3.16 ERA and 237 strikeouts during the regular season. On the other side, the Minnesota Twins completed the regular season with a record of 87-75 and clinched the American League Central Division title, finishing nine games ahead of second-place Detroit. The Twins lost their final regular season game to the Colorado Rockies 3-2 but had secured the division title well in advance, winning five of their last seven games. Leading the way for Minnesota is first baseman Donovan Solano with a 282 batting average, right fielder Max Kepler with 24 home runs and 66 RBIs, and shortstop Carlos Correa with 118 hits and an on-base percentage of 312. Starting for the Minnesota Twins in the game will be Pablo Lopez, who held an 11-8 record during the regular season with a 3.66 ERA and 234 strikeouts. In terms of a prediction, you anticipate that the game will have a total score exceeding 7.5 runs. This expectation is based on recent struggles for both starting pitchers and a trend where the over has been successful in 7 of Toronto's last 10 games and in 5 of Minnesota's last 7 games. While you predict that the Toronto Blue Jays will win, you consider the safer bet to be the game going over 7-5 in terms of total run score. The NL Wild Card Series opener is scheduled to take place at American Family Field on Tuesday night between the Arizona Diamondbacks and the Milwaukee Brewers. To stay informed about MLB playoff action, you can check out our MLB picks. The Diamondbacks 84-78 secured the final wild card spot despite losing their last four games and currently ranked 20th in the majors with a team ERA of 4.48. Notably, All-Star outfielder Corbin Carroll leads Arizona with a 285 batting average and an impressive 54 stolen bases. First baseman Christian Walker contributed significantly with a team-high 33 home runs and 103 RBIs. For the Diamondbacks, Rookie right-hander Brandon Fott 5.72 ERA will be making his 19th career major league start. In his last outing, Fott struck out eight batters over five plus innings in a 3-0 road victory against the Chicago White Sox. On the other hand, the Milwaukee Brewers 92-70 have won 49 of their 81 home games and have clinched the NL Central Division title in two of the last three years. To make a deep postseason run, the Brewers will rely on their pitching staff which led the majors with a 3.71 team ERA. Milwaukee shortstop Willie Adams leads the team with 24 home runs and 80 RBIs. Taking the mound for the Brewers is 2021 NL Cy Young Award winner Corbin Burns 10-8, 3.39 ERA. Burns has posted impressive numbers, including 200 strikeouts and 193-plus innings, while allowing 22 home runs and maintaining a stellar 1.7 whip. As for the prediction, you suggest the under 7.5 total runs for this game. It's worth noting that Milwaukee relief pitcher Elvis Piguero is expected to return from the 15-day injured list for this series. Arizona currently ranks 17th in OPS and 14th in runs scored over 162 games, while Milwaukee ranks 23rd in OPS and 17th in runs scored for the season. Your final score prediction is a Milwaukee Brewers win with a score of 4-1. The final game on Tuesday's MLB Wild Card schedule will feature a matchup between the Miami Marlins and the Philadelphia Phillies at Citizens Bank Park. If you're looking to stay updated on MLB playoff action, you can check out our MLB picks. The Marlins 84-78 are making just their fourth postseason appearance in franchise history and have a middle-of-the-pack pitching staff with a team ERA of 4.22. Notably, 
All-Star second baseman Luis Ariz led the majors with an impressive 354 batting average, and designated hitter Jorge Soler contributed significantly with a team-high 36 home runs. Taking the mound for the Marlins is 26-year-old left-handed pitcher Jesus Luzardo 10-9, 3.63 ERA. Luzardo has pitched 178 plus innings, allowing 22 home runs while striking out 208 batters and maintaining a 1.22 win. On the other side, the Philadelphia Phillies made a wild card playoff appearance last year and carried that momentum to the World Series. The Phillies 89-73 have won 49 of their 81 home games and finished 8th in the majors with 220 home runs. Lead of hitter Kyle Schwarber connected on 47 home runs, and outfielder Nick Castellanos led Philadelphia with 106 RBIs. Starting for the Phillies in the series opener is the hard-throwing right-hander Zach Wheeler 13-6, 3.61 ERA. In three starts against Miami this season, Wheeler logged 18 innings, allowing 15 hits and six runs while striking out 17 batters. Your prediction suggests an under 7.5 total runs for this game. It's worth noting that Philadelphia's shortstop Tria Turner, who was dealing with an elbow injury, is expected to play in this game. Miami currently ranks 19th in OPS and 26th in runs scored over 162 games, while Philadelphia ranked 6th in OPS and 8th in run score for the season. The final score prediction is a Philadelphia Phillies win with a score of 4-2.